What's going on guys? Have you ever thought about staying at an all-star resort? Better yet, have you thought about what am I gonna have for breakfast the morning I stay at an all-star music resort? Well, let's find out. What's going on guys, Mr. Tech Bot here. I am at All Star Music. Um, we spent the night with family, um, beautiful location. If you wanna see more information about the resort, go ahead and hit up my TikTok, um, as well as there's probably some shorts going around. Anyways, um, we're out here, of course, this morning we're getting ready to head out to the park and we need breakfast. So what do you do? Well, I could go outside, go to McDonald's, could go to an outside place, we could go to a, a dining restaurant but it all depends on what your budget is for us i think let's just have breakfast at the resort and then we'll head out to the parks so i think that's going to be the easiest uh the way everyone gets happy everyone gets full and everyone enjoys themselves i've never really had breakfast at any one of the resort places so what do they have to offer i'm sure it's going to be something involved with mickey waffles typical um of what they have but what else what are they going to have for adults i mean if you don't feel like mickey waffles what is there so we're gonna go find out. We're gonna go see what they have to eat. Um, we're gonna go see how much this costs because of course, you know, if you're out here on a budget, especially being at the all-star resort, um, you're gonna wanna be able to find ways to save money. Um, let's see if this is cost effective and let's see if this is something that can fill up the entire family. Maybe it's something that can help you on your next Disney World vacation out here at the all-star music resort. So we're in here, intermission area, of course, they have lots of good things. You need coffee, you can get your Joffrey, Scoffrey items. Of course, they got the dessert items as well. We've also got assorted items. We got some, looks like coffee cakes, some muffins, croissants, some bagels, cookies, danishes. If you're staying on resort, if you're staying on resort, one of the best things you have to get is these mugs. Yes, they are expensive. But if you're staying for a couple days, they are worth it. First station here, we got the uh, things like the waffle bounty platter, the ham and cheese omelet, the plant based Mickey shaped vegetable, and cheese ricotta. That's interesting. And then let's see what we got over here. So it looks like they've got kind of the same stuff, but a little bit more. If you want the vegetarian one, you go to the other side. Uh, we got the again the waffle bounty platter, the bacon shaped waffles, no pancakes, no pancakes with berry compote. We got a bacon, egg and cheese bagel, egg and cheese bagel sandwich, and a plant based Mickey shaped waffle. All sound good. <laughs> tater tots and Mickey waffles. We got the little one, some extra sausages, because she likes sausages. And of course this one came with it. I got a bagel, egg and cheese, and we also got some extra croissants and stuff like that. So of course you can't go wrong with Mickey waffles. So we're gonna break into this and see what we think. All right, so the bagel, cheese bagel, comes pre-made, they don't assemble it there. And it's a really big egg piece. Cheese is somewhat melted. Would have liked it to be a little hotter, but the bagel is nice and soft. Um, tater tots, of course, nice and crisp. The waffles have a good softness to it. Um, so far, kids are enjoying it. Let me give this another bite. Sometimes, I'm not sure on the first bite. You know, you take what you what you enjoy. 
Um, no, nobody at the top. It's not going to be anything from a restaurant or something like that. But if you want some basic foods, some basic breakfast items to get out before the parks, this is probably pretty solid. Now, one thing I did forget to mention, um, with the kids' meals, uh, they do come with a drink. So do remind me, you can get soft drink uh, with a cup, a normal cup. Uh, you get milk, apple juice, um, chocolate milk, stuff like that. So the meals do come with drinks, so do keep that in mind for your parents. Um, now, we didn't get a big plethora because as a family, sometimes we just like to share because um, some one kid doesn't like one thing, one kid doesn't like the other, and, you know, we we don't tend to want to eat overly at breakfast because you don't want to feel overly full and get ready to go to the park so it just doesn't make any sense so that entire meal was probably roughly about 30 bucks to be honest disney somewhat affordable because if you go to a character meal, you're going to pay more than that just for an adult so overall i'd say if you're going to come out here solid meal solid breakfast definitely would recommend it and you know for anybody that comes out here to stop and get breakfast here before going to the parks because sometimes you're going to pay a lot more in the park now you can't find some one-off items in the parks but um stop here get some breakfast and then go to the parks that's what i would recommend um it wasn't overly crowded now mind you it doesn't seem like the resort's overly crowded this week if you come to a time like spring break or something like that it might be a lot more overcrowded but Take advantage of it and uh, enjoy. Atmosphere around here is great. They even got some cartoons um, playing in the lobby for the kids. So, you know, always a great idea. So, if you like this video, I'd always appreciate it if you hit that like button along with leave me a comment. If you have any other questions um, that I did not answer in this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell so that way you get notified of all the most recent videos I do. Other than that, guys, as I always like to say, do what you like, do what you love, and always, guys, never forget to unleash your nerd. Y'all take it easy. Later.